It's hot. 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 Look at that. And even the cat <laughs> is relaxing. With the sunshine. Yeah. So I'm gonna get some water. Got my QR. Very nice. Man living in this house, or family living in this house now, which is good. So we have a bed outside. Nice little breeze once you're in the shade, and as you get in the sun, it's hot. I went out for something to eat today. Hotel, isn't it? So, uh, oh, look, there it is. The breakfast joint, pretty cool. I like that place, but I've just had Jolly Bee. Uh, so, yeah, so today was about popping down downtown. Uh, that was a bit of a crazy, crazy trip, really. They're doing masses and masses and masses of uh, roadworks in downtown Davao. Um, so what normally takes like 25 to 30 minutes to get down here on the scooter took me nearly an hour today. An hour! Oh my god! Dear me! It's the end of the world! As we know it. It's the end of the world as we know it. Yeah, so they're putting in... Uh, Electrical cables under the road. So that's what they're actually doing. So all that spaghetti you can see up in the air is going to be moved underground, and they're going to be doing that down around San Pedro, Fulton Bridge. <coughs> so while I was down there, I also popped into the Bureau of the Inland Revenue for the Philippines. because I need to get a TIN number I think it's a tax identification number so I need to get that for YouTube because um, YouTube has sent me a uh, piece of paper saying that I've got to make a declaration for the US government in the Philippines uh, because if I get paid any money from YouTube I will be taxed on it in America strange really isn't it how that works not taxed on it in the UK but taxed on it in the USA um, but, uh, everybody has to pay their taxes Hey, everybody has to pay. So this way is going to Gmail. This way is going to Bahada. And I'm going this way. Down the back of a Brero. Yeah? So... I've had some fluids and I had a little bit to eat which is pretty cool really because I felt like garbage when I came out of the uh, Bureau of Internal Revenue so uh, 
Yeah, I just, uh, I think I've got my body too run down on energy and fluid, so uh, I feel better. Somebody got just tried to run me off the road about five minutes ago, so uh, I was in the middle lane, like well, this, well, most lanes go straight across. He was on the left-hand side lane like this. Well, I see this guy here in the red. So he's in the wrong lane. Because he's in the lane to go straight across like me. Uh, and then he turns left. But, uh, yeah. One of those things, isn't it? One of those things that you get now and then. Uh, I'm going to go do some shopping today. So I'm doing this via the motor vlog. Uh, they wouldn't let me. Look at this guy. The lady boss. Go on, little lorry, go on, little lorry. Don't let, look at that guy. Cuts me under, cuts me over. Do you what you wanna do? Do you what you wanna do? Alright, on, right on, right on. one of those bits of cable hanging down big bends there we're going left haven't been down here for a while car wash straight across to a breezer Go straight across. Oh, look, see, this road is already being dug up left and right. Oh, oh. <laughs> Massive rainstorm in the middle, middle of the night last night, about four o'clock. It was really, really cold, so uh, that woke me up around half past four, five o'clock. And then you get one of those, uh, I'm up, I'm going to do something, and then you have a cat nap. So you have one of those little cat naps, and you have one of those little cat naps, and all of a sudden it's a six hour sleep. It's not a cat nap, it's a uh, full on comatose so I had that this morning got up around about 10 30 late rising really uh, Annie loves all of that she gets really really into having that uh, huggy huggy what's going on There's Aeon Towers there. Hello, Queer. You all? Thank you. 
Welcome, Goya. Thank you very much. So the jeepney goes, gets let through, the van gets let through, and he wants to see my seat. Lovely, lovely. Okay, a breezer mile. Lovely gardens, not going inside, but it's depressing. Um, I'm going to go do some shopping at SM today. So we'll go home, check out he's all right, and then I'll pop down in a taxi to do some shopping. So let's see if I can do a vlog inside SM Langen today, um, and then give an update on uh, prices. Give an update on what the impact is. See where the GDP is in the 20% rather than sitting down at 9. Oh, there we go. So, a breeze of on the right hand side. I come past here the other day in my pedicab, my Motorola. Tricycle. Oh, one of those funny little crash helmets on that young lady there, a pink one. Look at the traffic coming in to that bar. It's crazy, isn't it? I cut the corner of Bahada, oh, the taxi driver crossing a double yellow line going to get in. This taxi driver is actually facing the wrong way. Trying to do a U turn into the traffic. What golly! Uh, I don't know, maybe, maybe that is a legal move in the, in the Philippine Highway Code to drive the wrong way against the traffic and do a U-turn into the oncoming traffic. Maybe, I don't know. The LDT up there doing their spaghetti. Tying all those cables together so they're not all hanging down. I had a surprise this morning from uh, a postman. He knocked on the door at half past ten. That's what woke me up. So, uh, received my Christmas card today. For last Christmas. one of those people that uh, likes the old-fashioned way of doing things rather than the new way of doing things if that makes sense da -da -da. SPM, SPMC, there is a van down there turning left, there's this van coming out as well, yeah, there's a jeepney's all pulling up on this like hard shoulder, they've just tarmac this road, uh, but they've only put the white lines in the middle of the tarmac, they haven't put any cycle lane or any uh, any other demarcation for the middle or for the, for the right hand side shall I say so you have yellow lines over here which is don't cross then you have the white line but there's nothing on the inside to turn around and say it's for bicycles uh, there's a bike lane and whatever it is it's 
copy that. There's nothing here at all. I try and make that little slip road there, but right in the middle of the slip road is the um, lamppost. Yeah. So this is where they used to have the white line, see? Down here, there's a white line here, and this used to be a bike, bike lane. It was only put in about four months ago. But they've come and put this tarmac. And every, every time they put the time out, it gets deeper and deeper and deeper, it gets higher and higher and higher. So the camber gets very, very edgy down here. So it comes like that, rather than coming like that and then into the gully, it comes like that into this big area. And this area where them two bikes are sitting, when it rains, that just fills up with water. And nobody wants to travel through it because they can't see rocks or holes or whatever it is while you're riding in the water riding through the water in the dry it's okay so yeah cheers you got hey queer Corsaka my old man my man okay now slowly slowly sorry slowly Video, 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 video. There we go. Let's go. Okay, lad. Water. Say okay, lad. Yeah. So let's get some water. Taxi drivers are bibbing because they see the foreigner walking on the side of the road. Uh, it is hot. Uh, I'm going to come in here for three minutes. A coffee and some uh, water. I know if I need water first. Well done. Very well, choking! Perfect. 